In this video, we're going to show the procedure for updating your new controller firmware on a Mac. This procedure is recommended for advanced users only, as it involves using terminal and command line tools. The first step is to download the latest firmware from support.aquaillumination.com. On our support page, click the post called Firmware Downloads, and at the bottom of the page, you'll see a link for the latest firmware file. Once downloaded, verify its location and make a note of its path. The easiest way to do this is to right-click or control-click on the file and select Get Info. The path is listed under the Where section. Write down the full path and the file name. We'll need it later. Plug in the USB cable to your controller and to your Mac. On the controller, go to Menu. Select More. And scroll down to the Firmware Update option. Then tap Select. This will pop up a warning. Double check that your USB cable is connected and tap OK. The controller will restart into firmware update mode. Now back on the computer, we need to open Terminal. You can click on Launchpad, click Other, and select Terminal. On older versions of Mac OS X, you can find it in the Applications folder under Utilities. On the command line, type mount and press enter. The mount command will list all of the mounted volumes on your computer, including the AI controller. In the results, you should see a volume called aqua underscore illumin. Write down its path as we'll need it later. In this example, it's forward slash volumes forward slash aqua underscore illumin. Now that we have all the required information, we can copy the new firmware file to the controller. The following command will overwrite the existing firmware on the controller with the new updated file. Type dd space conv equals no trunk space if equals the path to the downloaded firmware file space of equals the path to the aqua underscore illumin volume forward slash firmware dot bin and press enter. Your results should look similar to this. Eject the aqua underscore illumin device from Finder. And reset your controller by unplugging the USB cable and plugging it in again. Verify the new firmware by going to the menu, More, and back to Firmware Update to view the new version number. Tap Cancel until you're back at the main screen. For more information, visit us at support.aquaillumination.com.